So we're here in Liverpool on the Mersey Loop Line, which links the Widow to Liverpool. The line was built in the 1970s, so it's now come to its life expired duration, and we do have to complete this final phase. It includes the installation of new track slab through three tunnel sections and four platforms. So the project's been in planning for 18 months to two years now. The project itself will take five months to deliver, and for us to be able to create the plan to deliver it in that period of time, which required key stakeholders to all get together collaboratively, and that includes our client network rail, and the train operating company, Mersey Rail themselves. The initial phases of the project saw us install various temporary services. This included ventilation, which allowed for a clean, safe working environment for the operatives, additional lighting, and it also required the provision of water and air and electricity into the network. To allow for the new track slab to be installed, this required us to break out over 1,600 tonne of material. This was loaded into engineering trains and taken out of the network for recycling. The project required 170 metres cube of concrete to be poured. For this to happen, we needed to deliver it by road, then pump it from street level down into the underground via a wagon mounted pump. This was loaded into Story's on track concrete plant. We would then transport this round the loop line to the location that we needed to pump it once again, a good 140 metres up the track into position. Part of the project has seen us install 2,400 metres of new running rails. These were delivered in 108 metre length ahead of the blockade, then then transported into position and installed onto the new Viper base plates. This project has seen us continue from our previous visits where we've installed the Viper base plates. What these base plates allow is a more maintenance friendly way to maintain the track. The project has seen 3,600 Viper base plates installed, with each base plate requiring four hold down locations. We have seen over 14,000 bolts installed throughout. Working 24 7 on the project with a free shift pattern, this equates to over 90,000 working man hours. The walkway gratings that we've installed on this phase are more lightweight, making them safer to install and more maintenance friendly. So we've now completed the project here in Liverpool where we've replaced 1,200 metres of track slab. The projects require 24-7 hour working with the commitment of all our operatives and subcontractors to ensure that the project has been delivered on time, to budget and more importantly safely. So a project has been challenging and complex here underground where it's required real collaboration between Network Rail, Mersey Rail, Story Contracting and all our key stakeholders. My proudest moment has been walking around the loop Remembering what it was like when we first started, going through every platform now and just seeing like the finished picture now. Proud of myself, but also proud of everybody else that I've worked with because it's been a massive team effort. No individual can, can take claim to it. It's the story team that's delivered it and it's absolutely spot on. Firstly, thank you to our customers and community for their patience during the World Loop track renewals. A big thank you to those that have worked under the city unseen 24-7 to deliver the improvements that will benefit the city region in the longer term. The collaborative approach between Story Contracting, Network Rail, Mersey Travel, ourselves and the other agencies have helped deliver a successful project and kept the city region moving. The project's done really well, uh, we've delivered all the works to um, programme, cost and quality. That's not to say that we haven't had our challenges along the way, but um, by working in collaboration with Story Contracting, Mersey Rail and Mersey Travel, uh, we've been able to overcome these challenges and deliver a successful project. I just want to take this opportunity to sort of thank like, sort of the full team, like, sort of not only the guys that have been sort of out working both day and night to like, obviously deliver the project, but the support like, sort of, that's been received from like, sort of, all the team up in the offices, um, like sort of, the likes of Network Rail, Mersey Rail, that have all collaborated together to make the, sort of, the project the success that it is. Finally, I'd like to take this opportunity just to say a huge thank you to everybody that's involved with the project. That's our client network rail, our key stakeholders, Mersey Rail, all our subcontractors and all our operatives. Each and every one of them has shown 100% commitment into the delivery of such a fantastic project for the client.